With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. A long solenoid is fabricated by closely winding a wire of radius 0.5 mm over a cylindrical non-magnetic frame so that the successive turns nearly touch each other okay so all turns nearly touch each other okay what would be the magnetic field be at the center of the solenoid if it carries a current of 5 ampere okay so first of all we have given the cross section radius of the wire so cross section radius of the wire that is small r is 0.5 mm so cross section diameter of wire will be 2r so this will be equals to 1 mm and this can be given as 10 to the power minus 3 meter okay and we have given that this is a long solenoid that means this radius uh, this length is uh, too much greater than the radius then this is called as long solenoid so at the center the magnetic field due to this current the current is given as 5 ampere so at the center of the solenoid magnetic field can be given as mu naught n into i okay where small n is given as number of turns number of turns per unit length number of turns per unit length okay so as we have given that all the successive turns nearly touch each other so if we talk about for one turn uh, for one turn that is n upon uh, x so for one turn we can say that is one and for length of one turn will be diameter of cross section okay so we can say that uh, 10 to the power minus 3 so this will be equals to uh, number of turns per unit length will be 10 to the power 3 so just uh, we have to use this value over here so mu naught can be given as 4 pi into 10 to the power minus 7 n is given as 10 to the power 3 and current is given as 5 so we can say that 4 into 5 will be 20 pi multiplied by 10 to the power minus uh, 4 okay so we can write it as uh, 2 pi multiplied by 10 to the power minus 3 and pi can be given as 3.14 okay so we can say that magnetic field at the center of the solenoid is 2 pi into 10 to the power minus 3 tesla or we can say that 2 into 3.14 that will be 6.28 uh, multiply by 10 to the power minus 3 tesla so this also is the answer of this problem this can also be the answer of the problem okay so 6.28 into 10 to the power minus 3 tesla is the answer uh, thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today